Units and Dimensions Dimensions All quantities that can be measured are called dimensions. For example, mass is a quantity that we can measure. So, mass is a dimension. Similarly, length, which is also a measurable quantity, is a dimension. Time is another example for dimension. Units The standards used for measuring dimensions are called units of measurement. For example, kilograms is a unit for measuring mass. Meters is a unit for measuring length. Seconds is a unit for measuring time. To summarize, all measurable quantities are called dimensions. The standards for measuring dimensions are called units. Systems of units. Remember the definition for units? Units are the standards used for measuring dimensions. They are the standards. Different standards are followed in different parts of the world. The most popular ones are CGS system of units, FPS system, MKS system and the SI system. Of all the systems available in the world, the SI system of units is the most widely used standard. Base units and derived units Base units Every standard defines the units for measuring a few basic set of dimensions such as mass, distance, time, etc. They are called base units. Derived units Once the base units are available, you can derive the units for measuring more complex dimensions. For example, the SI system provides the unit meters for measuring length. Similarly, it provides the unit seconds for measuring time. We know that speed is equal to distance traveled divided by time taken. So the unit for measuring speed would be the unit for measuring the distance traveled divided by the unit for measuring time that is meters by second. Speed can be measured in meters per second. So we use the base units meters and seconds to derive the unit for measuring speed. Such units that you can derive from base units are called derived units. In this session we learned the definitions for dimensions and units, the various systems of units and the difference between base units and derived units.